find cos 1050 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 1050 now you should check 1050 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 1050 lies between 900 and 1080 this is 180 into 5 this is 180 into 6 between these two numbers 1050 lies next now 1050 is close to which number this is close to 1080 so 1050 now should be written as 1080 minus 30 so this will become cos in place of this we should write this 1080 minus 30 this is your step 1 next cos in place of this now we should write 6 into 180 minus 30 next here we have 180 so cos is not going to change it will remain cos and inside we get this angle 30 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 6 and 6 is even and all the even multiples of 180 they lie in either in the first or in the fourth quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have negative that means angle lies in the fourth quadrant and in the fourth quadrant cos is positive so we should put plus so plus cos 30 is root 3 by 2 this is our answer